children are always expected to be happy and to smile. And even later, when someone wants to take a picture of us, we are always asked to smile. That could also be what we too often expect from art. A work of art is always measured by its success. Perhaps this is where my close relationship with disappointment and its possibilities lies. And I keep coming back to it. I've been thinking about playgrounds and also about the complications and limitations of playgrounds. I was quite wondering why it is all about activation and where should an interruption take place? How can one enjoy the unfair and leave the misfits be misfits? Sculpture, art in general, is not there to make things more suitable than society expects of us. Art shouldn't bear the burden of anticipating success. The sculptures here are nervously painted, like an adult mimicking a child. Just let it be unfinished, and don't be afraid of the imperfection or incompletion. Just not be afraid of the surface. We always restore, retouch, redefine, and recreate pieces. Art does suggest to combine things and words, which sometimes and seemingly do not make sense at all. It allows mistakes, misreadings, mismatchings. It creates misfits. <laughs> 